know that uh, all Crimean Tatars um, and uh, people who uh, who think that who, who know that Crimea is Ukraine, they are not suffered suffer. And I know that new authorities uh, closed Crimean Tatar lab libraries and uh, closed uh, communities, some, some communities, uh, and a lot of young people move out of Crimea now. I really, I really worry about it so much. I worry about my family. I worry about my grandfather, my father, mother, and all relatives uh, um, because they live there. And, but I don't know the recipe, unfortunately. I'm just a musician. I don't know how to help, but how to solve this situation. But still, the songs, your art could help these people. I hope so. I hope that my personal story um, could help to understand what was behind this lyrics, what was behind this name 1944. It's my personal story. It's per a story of my great grandmother. It's a, a story about tragedy which happened with all Crimean Tatars in 1944. And it, it, it completely changed our life. You know, that's why, because every Crimean Tatar suffered uh, because uh, of this deportation, you know? That's why I, I, it's uh, really important for me to uh, sing this song and uh, to share this story uh, using, this cont using this context, why not? You know, for me, it's just a memory, it's just, uh, uh, just uh, to commemorate uh, my great-grandmother my uh, family, all Crimean Tatars, um, you know, it's just, it's, just, it's just personal thing. It's not uh, political at all, that's why. I'm, I'm pretty sure that there is no some, some other, other things on, on my song uh, than you, you can hear it. When strangers are coming, they come to your house, they kill your house and say we're not guilty, not guilty. Where is your mind? Humanity cries, you think you are God, but everyone dies. Don't swallow my soul, our souls. Mm -hmm. I, I was grown uh, on the mu music uh, by Ella Fitzgerald, Billie Holiday, uh, Al Jura, Stevie Wonder, and so on. And uh, of course, I. Um, it's the music of struggle, though. I mean, yeah, it's a big yeah, part. yeah. I think that creating the future, uh, we should remember our roots, where we came from. And if you respect and venerate your, uh, your family, your history, your culture, uh, I'm sure that you learn how to respect other cultures.